Yo, what's going on, sexy Sam underscore? Today we're here doing a rank one v one, and uh, it's crazy. The new patch is out, and if you don't know about the new patch, I've made my opinion of it very, 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 very clear. Um, I think it's a bad patch because it takes away uh, damage from damage dealers and forces them to go tank. Because uh, if you don't know the patch, let me just go over it real quick with you. Let me go to my profile. And these are the patch notes. So just real quick, I know it's a big patch. So uh, shutdown bonuses is a little bit lower. This, all the other stuff only matters for conquest. Um, soul surges, whenever you kill someone, there's gonna be a big circle that spawns around them. Don't be frightened. That big circle will happen on every kill. Um, it has a two minute internal timer, so it won't happen all the time. There will be little ghosties that spawn up from the middle of it. They're kind of tanky. They don't give that much gold and XP, but they are probably worth killing if you have the time. Um, all tier three items. This is why I think tanks will rule. Hold on, let me look at my timer. This is why I think tanks rule the game. All tier three items have decreased physical and magical power by 30%, and tank items only have a 15% reduction. So tanks got 15% stronger. Mages got 30% weaker. Or I, I guess technically speaking... Mages, ADCs, Assassins, you know, they all got 30% weaker. And Solos and Guardians only got 15% weaker. Um, they obviously have different buffs and nerfs and stuff. And um, that was from the old patch. So, yeah, this this is a pretty massive patch. And this is why I think that Hercules is going to be the best dual god, period. Period, period, in duel. Look at how much damage Transcendence has. Fully stacked. When it's max stacked, evolved completely, it gives you like 55 power, maybe 65. Um, so you're not going to be doing a whole lot of damage. But what you can do is you can start Genji's because you're already not doing a ton of damage, right? So why do you care? My favorite. Hmm? Why do you care? I'm instead of missing out on what? What is it? 20 power? Instead of missing out on 20 power, I'll miss out on all of it. But I'll have 77 magical prots because this tier two still gives 40 magical prots. Also, Genji's Pestilence, they're all still pretty good. 60 magical prots instead of 70. Pestilence is 70 instead of 80. It lost uh, 50 health, but yeah, all still good. I do think, like I said, it's not even going to be close. I think that um, tanks are going to run the game. And I think Hercules is... Well, Hercules, Chalk, Guan Yu, Amaterasu... All the big healer gods are really going to run this game now. And it's not going to be close, I think. Um, obviously, he's going to outclear me. He's freaking Anubis, and I'm a zero power Hercules at the moment. By trade, by trade. But yeah, it's going to be comical when you see how much damage he does to me. Obviously, tier two Talon didn't get changed. You know what's so funny? Tier 2 Bancroft's talent, guess what? It has 65 power. Guess what tier 3 Bancroft's has? 70. <laughs> You're paying 1,100 gold for fit, for 5 more power. And obviously the passive, but you know. Let's see if I can kill him here. Okay, that definitely should have knocked up. On Fortnite. So yeah, it's uh it's pretty miraculous just the things the things that happen behind the scenes over at Hyra's, I guess. I want that. Okay. Alrighty. Um can you kill me? Nice. Oh, look. That's the big soul thing. There's going to be some ghosties that spawn out of that. You can see the big black hole on my mini map. Um, there's going to be some ghosts that spawn out of it. And any god in that area, whether you're friendly or enemy, doesn't matter, uh, will be attacked by said ghosties. So they do like four damage. Honestly, it's kind of irrelevant. But it's a thing. I'm going to go beat stick just because I want some anti-heal. And I mean, a little bit of power is fine. So oh, look. 
He spent 1100 gold for five power. And, and like I said, a passive, passive, but that's kind of the trade at this point. Like, uh, what you're going to realize is almost every single item, their tier two is going to be very close to power in the tier three, but the tier threes have passives. So, you know, it's worth it. Oh man. My two was going to go off. How much damage do you do? 47. Okay. You autoed me for 30. I did not mean to hit you. I apologize. I'll stand in this. I'm cool with it. You cool if I hang out here, though? Want to be besties? No. No besties today? All right. If you incest. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. I just, I really just felt like it. I needed that in my life. You know what I mean? Treasure chest should be spawned. Oh man, they're in the bad spawn. Damn it. Now the reason um, tanks are so good, by the way, other than having higher base damage numbers than mages and assassins, because so mages, assassins, and hunters, they, they have decent base damage, but most of their damage comes from the scaling power. Whereas warriors and guardians in particular, have uh, higher base damage with less actual scaling, meaning that having lower damage overall really helps the tanks. So we are going to be in a tank meta. You're, I've, I've seen already so many screenshots of uh, mid laners going triple defense, ADCs having like prophetics and arc druids and stuff like that. It, it's, it's a lot that's going to change. So just be ready for it, okay? Just be ready for it. If you are a mid laner, a jungler, or an ADC, I would recommend um, one of two things. Build the fence or switch your role. That's all I can really recommend. Let's grab this. Oh, by the way, Pridwin, um, which I am going to buy. It got a glyph, and this glyph does 75% of your damage. Uh... 25 i'm sorry 75 percent of your protections as damage in an explosion just like normal pridwin but that one does it twice so that's the glyph i'm going to be getting today can i have that please thank you uh that is absolutely the glyph i'm going to be getting i think it's probably the best glyph in the game i was running around with it in conquest and uh you solo anyone you look at basically <laughs> hello hey defense Do, 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 Oh man, that hit him. Why does this keep happening to me? All right. Fine. Oh. Let me get your treasure chest though, while I'm here. Might as well. I definitely can't kill him. Uh, I could go Pestilence and just cap out on my anti-heal. I might as well, honestly, right? Oh, by the way, they also reverted nerf. Or, reverted nerf. They reverted the pen nerf. So, uh, the pen was like 8%, 16% you know, 4% instead of 5 Now, the pen cap is back up to 40%. So, in case you're wondering. Let's go Pestilence. And then after Pestilence, I, I'll, I'll buy some damage items. Because you still do need a little bit of damage. I'll probably go Serrated. Because that's an OP item. Um, and then I might go Heartseeker. Although Heartseeker is not that great. Because it, it goes off of physical power. And you don't get a lot of that anymore. So maybe I won't go Heart Seeker. Maybe I'll just go Crusher, which also goes off your physical power. Those items got really nerfed, huh? Um. Okay. So I'll go Pestilence. And then I'll go...
And then I'll go... I'll build Pestilence, and then I'll build... I don't know, dude. I can't figure it out. Oh, I want Pridwin, too. Okay, so here's the plan. I think what we do, we go Serrated, Crusher, Pridwin. We will have triple defense. Pridwin will explode twice, which will do buku amounts of damage. Hello. Wrap me. Yep, hit me, hit me, hit me, hit me, hit me. 52 damage. That's unlucky for you, because I heal a lot. I'm ready to fight. You tick me for 27. I am still a tank after all. These are my days. Hello? I'm going to just do this out. I'm not very physically tanky, I will admit. You want to stop me at red? Bazinga! Hit. <laughs> Bonk. <laughs> Isn't it so cute how he wraps me and then full combos and I still out-trade him with, like, ease, too? Nice. So, inside this little orb, by the way, you get extra movement speed, I believe. Uh, you get extra... It says, attacks burn enemy gods. I, I no fucking idea what that means. Wait, you followed me out of the... So I didn't even know you could do that, dude. Hello. Oh, they died. Damn it. I get serrated. He did get divine. Good play. Good play. I like the divine play. He needs it. Uh, how much damage did I take, by the way? From his 1 and 3 and alt, they only did 300 each. Meanwhile, <laughs> meanwhile, the tank, who has two two tank items, uh, my 1 did two, 230. My alt did more damage than his alt. I don't know where you are right now, but I don't care because I'm, I'm alting this. I'm hitting your phoenix. I'm deceased. <laughs> Whatever. No. Um, you do probably have your alt up, huh? So I should be maybe a little bit scared. Nice. Nice. I gotta go get my power spike so I can win these fights. Power spike. Thank you, thank you. I have two defense and two tank. Or I'm sorry, I have two tank and two damage. 65 power with two items. Granted, uh, serrated passive did not get touched. So serrated is probably single-handedly the best item in the game. Because it gives you 20% pen, 55 power. And 16% uh, lifesteal. It was already very good, but since they lowered damage and they didn't lower the, the passive of Serrated, uh, it's it's very, very strong now. So I was a huge proponent in always buying Serrated if you were like a melee character, like a warrior or an assassin. I now am a gigantic proponent where if you don't, you're actually stupid. It does as much damage as Transcendence while giving you 20% pen and lifesteal. Just saying. You should buy it. If you don't, I'm going to think weirdly of you. Hello. What's up, buddy? Don't. You actually can't play the video game, by the way. Ow. Okay, hold on. He blinked. He's a Blinkus. All right. All right, Blinkus. Well played. Whatever, I don't need minions. I am a minion. I'm starting to think, you know what's crazy too? They didn't even nerf Hercules. Hercules was like a meta uh, pick in both Duel, Joust, and Conquest. And they didn't nerf him. They made tanks better, and they made healers better because... So the reason healers are better, by the way, 
There's the anti-heal cap, so you can't ever have 100% anti-heal, which is kind of a buff to healers. Not really, but kind of. Um, But then on top of that, if you lower the damage dealt by everything in the game, which is what they did exactly, um, then your health becomes much more effective. Like, when you heal, you're not healing 75 health for it to be taken away in an auto attack. You're healing 75 health for it to be taken away in two auto attacks, which is literally twice as much time. So it's uh, it's pretty massive. It's pretty massive. Healers are really, really strong. Um, tank healers specifically are really strong. If you're playing a mage, like Chang is really strong. Obviously, anyone that can get health back is really strong. I want to get this glyph because I want to show you how cool it is. So this glyph, when you buy it, it uh, it's a long thing, so I'm not going to read it, but I'll tell you what it does. As soon as you alt, your Pridwin explodes in a radius. So your alt does damage, and then your, your Pridwin does damage. And then, after the normal Pridwin amount of time, like four or five seconds, then your secondary explosion happens, and and that's when you get the, the additional damage. By the way, his three, three ticks of it hit me, which is almost the entire ability. There's only four ticks that ability can even do. Three ticks of it hit me, and it did less than what my initial heal does. It hit me for 174. My heal heals for one. I, well, it says 165, but it's 175, I guess. I don't know why, because I the number popped up and it was 175. Regardless, I have this thing now. So I'm going to blink on him, and I'm going to alt him. And you'll see the explosion. It's not going to do that much damage because I'm not like full, 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 full tank. Oh, he wrapped me mid one. All right, you're cool. Honestly, I'm not. Oh, okay. Honestly, you're way cooler than me. I'll never be as cool as you, and I need to start learning to accept that now. That's on me. My bad. Okay. Hello? I actually do a dummy amount of damage. Oh. There you go. Oh, you saw that? You saw the double print win? It only did 76 damage because he was immune to one of them for some reason. I don't know why, but that was cool. It was sick. Hello. It's funny how you damage me, but it doesn't actually hurt. Isn't that interesting? Hello. Do you think you can kill me? Because I don't. All right. All right. All right. All right. Oh, minions. Wait, hold on. <laughs> oh, nice. You got the Phoenix again. Hello. Hello. Bro. I took what? Like 14 Titan shots? <laughs> I took like 14 Titan attacks of fucking alt to the face and my one and then walked it off. Nice. I, and now uh, my last item will just be a crusher. Just for funsies. In their just for funsies. Gain a shield equal to 90% of your protections when destroyed or timed out. You explode again. So it's 75% of your protections from items and abilities. So I need to use my three before I alt. Because this gives me 60 protections, which adds to my, my Pridwin buff. Which will add to my burst. Come on, buddy. I didn't mean to do that. I'm so deceased. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, Jesus. Ah, jeepers. Ah, jeepers creepers. Come on, Anubis. Come on, buddy. You and me. You and me, buddy. First the world, buddy. Oh, it didn't damage him. It didn't damage him, dude. It was so close. Oh. Killed the minion wave, though. Bro, my one hit him for 536. What in the universe? I'm triple defense. 
<laughs> By the way, he has obsidian shard for pen and he's got base pen on divine ruin divine ruin by the way went from 100 power to 70 that is so that's so unfortunate this also went from 100 power to 70 how much power does he have 375 wow that is not good that is not good at all dude 375 power are you serious they expect mages to kill people like that I am playing very poorly, by the way. Like, like, like really stupid. And I'm just walking at this dude and he can't do anything. I'm actually using 0% of my brain cells. A solid zero. Oh, I got to get this. Oh, okay. All right. Yep. All right. Okay. All right. All right. Fair enough. Fair enough. He got me. He got me while the Titan was hitting me and the Phoenix was hitting me and his ult was hitting me. <laughs> Your oh, that's ridiculous. That's so funny. Oh, that's really funny, actually. Holy crap. Are you getting my tower? Come on, get my tower. Oh, man. Unlucky. This god is just busted. I swear to you, if I played serious for like 0.4 seconds, this game ends. Because he just can't kill me. Like, I knew Phoenix was spawning, but I wanted to see if I could tank it. I'll be honest with you. That was a planned death. I mean, I didn't know I would die. So I guess I can't say it was a planned death. But it was... Um, I thought that I could tank it. So I did it on purpose. On porpoise, if you will. I'm just going to do Bull Demon again. Without his Titan and Phoenix doing an extra 1800 damage to me, I have a really hard time believing that he can kill me. Although this thing does hurt me. Ah, not bad enough, though. Oh, just give me, give me it. Hello. <laughs> yeah, see, that's what I'm talking about. If I play serious for like a half of a second, it's just like, what is he to do? What is he to do? I don't know. Genuinely no idea. Oh, my print one wasn't up yet. Damn it. All right. There we go. GG. Now you know what this meta looks like. Make sure that you adjust your game style and your gameplay accordingly because you will need to adjust it if you're not already like a hyper aggressive solo laner like me. Um, and yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time. Peace.